I am trying to upload vlogs every Wednesday now. I started out doing Sundays, but I figured that Sundays just didn't work so well for me. So we're gonna attempt Wednesdays. And um, I've got a lot of things still in the works. So I think we're good. I think I can do Wednesdays for at least two weeks. <laughs> and um, yeah, we'll see. Good morning, it is Wednesday today and in one of my previous vlogs, in one of my recent vlogs, I talk about that I should get up earlier. So today is the day. <laughs> it's like a week later or more even honestly and here we are. It was My alarm went up at 6.30 and it's 7am right now and I'm in the car to the gym, oh my god. Um, the reason for going to the gym this early, this is not my motivation for getting up early, getting a workout in, blah, blah, blah. that's not my aim. But I do have meetings at work all morning, and then I have the afternoon to do my actual job. So that doesn't leave me too much time to work out. So I was like, you know what? If I could get a workout in before my first meeting, that will make my life so much easier and I'm not taking time out it feels like I'm not taking time out of my day to go work out because it is before I would be up otherwise because otherwise I wouldn't I would only start getting up now so I might as well just get up honestly it's only half an hour earlier but I'm gonna have coffee my first meeting is at the roaster again and then coffee at the cafe <laughs> So, I'm gonna buy breakfast there and have a coffee. So, uh, this time I didn't, this morning I didn't have to worry about making coffee, making breakfast, showering, none of that, you know. I'm just, I'm just here with my tea. Cheers. Little LASIK update. My eyes are doing well. I am doing well. The thing that I noticed and I have said this in the LASIK vlog as well but I do notice that my left eye is not as good yet as my right and it might never be you know it never was <laughs> so it might never be but um, I can see feel the muscle my eye muscle I guess there's I think eight eye muscles but one of them at least <laughs> Is aching a little bit and I have had that for a long time so I think it's just strain but I do really hope that that is gonna go away as my eye heals because it shouldn't have to strain so much anymore to see so hopefully that pain is just gonna go away and if not I should probably get a skin done <laughs> yesterday I was working on a project that you're not gonna see for a few weeks because fingers crossed there is gonna be a before and after We'll see. Nature will decide on that one. I'm gonna stop filming now because I need to finish the... It's not really the outro, but the end of my yo yoga coffee vlog. Because as of yesterday, I am officially signed up as a yoga teacher at a local gym. And I'm... I'm not scared. Keep telling yourself that. Um, I'm very excited about it. It's not gonna make me much money because I did need to get yoga teaching insurance and that's gonna eat up. Like my whole five first classes that I teach, the money is just going straight to insurance. <laughs> so I'm not doing it for the money but for the experience which is great because I am still working on my yoga teaching certificate and this, this is the push I need because I do need that certificate to teach so yeah those are my updates this morning not sure what the rest of this vlog is gonna be honestly but oh yeah about my meetings um, one of them is at the cafe so fantastic I always say that and then I don't film shit there so we'll see if today is any different probably not <laughs> 
other than that, oh, the gym. I already forgot I was on my way to the gym. I would have gone straight to the cafe and just sat there and had my breakfast. No, but um, yeah, let me get to the gym. I think I'll, I will film a few things there if it's not too busy. I've never been this early in the morning to this specific gym. So we'll see how it goes. I have arrived at my destination. It's 7.24, so I made a good time. Um, my first um, impressions of this early hour is that there's a lot more cops on the roads, which is fine, safety first. And um, the parking lot doesn't seem that full, so we'll see how busy it is. Wake up day. I'm tired. I feel like I started out really well doing app stuff for 15 minutes as a warm up, and now I'm gonna play with some of these weights. But um, I'm feeling I've got a bit of a headache. I'm feeling a little bit lightheaded, so not ideal. But I'm gonna push through, take a shower, and have breakfast. Playing with these weights is waiting, way, waking me up. I can't speak anymore. But I'm feeling better now that I'm playing around a little bit. So let's continue. And I actually allowed myself a full hour to work out so that I didn't have to feel stressed or like I needed to go to work or anything. So my meeting is in an hour. So I've got another half an hour to work out and then get ready. was a success. I showered and everything. And um, now I'm away to the roaster. Oh boy. Had a lovely chat, had a lovely meeting, some breakfast, coffee, and now I'm walking to the office for my next meeting. Lovely. I'm back in a car, a lot has happened today and I'm exhausted but feeling good basically I was ready to leave and go back home and it started pouring down rain so my colleagues very kindly offered to drop me off where I left my car um, but it wasn't necessary because there was a little window of opportunity where it wasn't raining as much and I could walk back to my car so happy to did it I went for a lot of walks today actually three to be precise and it looks like it's gonna rain the rest of the night so that was it for my walk but parked by the roaster I picked up a new coffee and I feel like every time I see a coffee that I haven't tried before I'm skeptical because I don't know it's a citrus jasmine and caramel I'm excited to try that but let's go home Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Well, that's something else, isn't it? Wow. And now I've gotten into a jump style rabbit hole. Jump style, that was it, man. So funny.
And the survey says... Lecker. Yeah, it's a light roast. Not bad. The white squirrel has come to the feeder for breakfast. I'll make you the espresso part. Where is your coffee cup? In the rack. How are you going to make me special coffee? No, I'm not. I'm just going to make you an espresso part. Uh, you can make the rest of it. I thought you said special. Special coffee. Special. I'm <laughs> yeah, very. The squirrel has now gone into the tree. Oh, and now he's leaving. Cheers. Where are you going? Oh, back in the tree. There he is. The white squirrel is feeding on sunflower seeds. Maybe they sound like bubbles. <laughs> Not sound like bubbles. I just changed the bedsheets back in the old house, had some lunch, and now I'm drawing coffee outside. And as you can see, it's t-shirt weather. How exciting. Let's drink this and go for a walk. Hey, baby. Yeah, you're excited about the weather as well, huh? Those are our onions.
in our lavender bush. Look how I'm holding it. <laughs> I'm walking through the garden and I have spotted wildlife. There's so much sound coming from the bushes here as well. But I actually saw something. Let's see if he's still here. Probably already scared him off. Where did you go? I don't know where he went, but it was a turkey. Now, would you just look at that view? Catching the last few sun rays, sitting out here on my yoga mat, learning yoga things with my kitties. Good morning. It is time to investigate something in the yard because I was just looking out to the feeder and I spotted something and there was a little squirrel in it. So, speaking of squirrels, look at him. <laughs> I'm gonna see how he could have gotten in there. So for those of you who don't know how a deer feeder works, this is a little solar panel and then there's a timer on it and then this thing spins and throws out a handful of corn um, and we put some sunflower seeds in there as well, which looks like they loved it, um, the squirrels, I mean, but somehow a squirrel was literally in here, in this cage, bro. I think he would have gone through here. I think it will fit through there, which I don't think is a big deal, but it's not supposed to go like that. <laughs> it's not supposed to happen. Um, yeah, interesting, but I'm pretty sure that a squirrel can fit through there. Yeah, investigation complete. Look how beautiful our yard is. Every time I consider moving away from here, I think about not having this in my backyard or as my backyard. And I said, Monday and I am beating my neighbor to work. <laughs> um, it's 7 a.m. on a Monday and I'm on my way to the recycling center, then to the gym and then to work. So let's be productive. Let's have a productive Monday. I think it's to me, it's very important to start the Monday strong. So I always try to go into the office, get as much work done as possible and just have a strong start to the week. So that is what we're doing today. Let's go. All right, the trash has been dropped off and now I'm on my way to the gym. I am wearing sunglasses because my eyes are still sensitive to light, um, but it's not been too bad, to be honest. I just want to be protective of them because they cost me a lot of money. <laughs> so let's get to the gym. Today has been wildly productive already. It's 2 p.m. I've been to the dump for the recycling center, the gym, work, and I've been for a walk. And now I want to go grocery shopping, but I do realize that my car is full of bins. Um, 
So I'm not sure if it really makes sense. I do want to go to more Walmart and buy cat food though, so maybe I'll just do that and then go home. But if I do that, it means I have to go grocery shopping tomorrow and I don't want to. I'd rather do it today and get it all over with, but I um, don't know. I don't know. I'm waiting at the gas station and I've never had to wait here before. Some luxury problems. Hello, um, I made it home. Nice and early. I am walking, as you can tell. I should have worn shorts. I was thinking of wearing shorts. I was like, oh, it's not that warm. It's not summer yet. But it turns out it is that warm. <laughs> so it's lovely. And um, I just wanted to say, I got up early this morning because one of my previous vlogs, I said that I needed to get up earlier. So here I am doing it once a week, <laughs> which is not a big deal, but I feel like Mondays, to start off strong like that is a good start. Um, so I've had a very productive day so far, but now I feel like I'm getting in a energy dip and I don't know if I can be much more productive today. I do want to finish a little bit of work and do, I was watching a yoga uh, presentation for my yoga teaching course, so I'm gonna finish that as well. But I yeah, went to the recycling center, went to the gym, then to work, went for a walk on my lunch break, went to Walmart to buy cat food, got gas for the car, and now I'm home. So, like I said, very productive and I'm very happy that I got to have go home early today. I haven't been home this early uh, on an office day in a very long time. So I'm grateful for that. And now I'm just enjoying the sunshine a little bit. And like I said, do a little bit more work. But also I wanted to say, I feel like I've been very productive today, but I wish, or I don't know, there's no regrets, but it would have been nice if one of the other things that I had done today was vlog a little bit more. But it is what it is. You know, sometimes you just got to focus on the tasks at hand and I can't always film everything I do. And I don't always feel comfortable doing that either. So yeah, this is where we're at. My arm is honestly getting sore. I don't feel like I went that hard at the gym this morning, but I kind of did. Like all my muscles were burning. I was really working them out <laughs> hard. So proud of myself. And then tomorrow is a work from home day and a rest day in terms of gym. So maybe I'll do some outdoor yoga because I think t tomorrow is gonna be as nice of a day as today is. So maybe some outdoor yoga um just work really but yeah i'm really trying to work on this yoga teaching course uh, as time allows but then i'm also working on vlogs and now i'm completely neglecting the book that i've written so i don't know i just i need a break i need a vacation honestly i was talking to mariam today and i just need a vacation i haven't been on an official, I went away for the weekend when my mom was here, which was lovely. We went to Myrtle Beach and had a lovely time. But it wasn't a sun vacation, which I don't always need the sun. <laughs> and I'm walking in the sun, so it's not like that. But I haven't traveled since October, like the start of October. So November, December, January, February, March, that's five months ago now. Um, Tomorrow is exactly five months ago, I think, that I came back from my trip. So, it's time for another trip. Honestly, five months is a very long time. So, I need to figure something out. Actually, there might be a trip on the horizon. I know there are a couple of trips happening this year, but I haven't booked any of them yet. So, it doesn't really feel real yet. So, I need to work on that too. Maybe I'll book some flights today. We'll see.
I already think controlling two pens at once is a lot, and here I am doing four. Saute sauce, tofu, vegetables, rice. Tofu, vegetables, etc. Good morning. It is my dad's birthday. Happy birthday. I already called him. I sang to him and then he turned the camera around and showed me that he actually had visitors. So that was lovely and embarrassing. <laughs> but it was nice. Mm. And now I am... Basically yesterday was a lovely day. It was like 20 degrees, sunny, and then halfway through the day it got kind of grey. But still warm and nice. So I thought, you know what, instead of going to the gym today, I can go for a run. Well, let me show you a close-up of the weather. It is raining pretty consistently, and it will rain the entire day. So, I don't know about that run. I also don't know about going to the gym, because it takes so much time out of my day, and I feel like I've been so busy lately, I just want a day at home to relax. But I don't want to skip the gym either. I like the gym. And like I said, I wanted to go for a run just because going for a run only takes half an hour out of my day, whereas going to the gym takes two hours out of my day. So we'll see, there might be in a window of opportunity where it doesn't rain today, but I doubt it. <laughs> and it will still be very wet and muddy, but we'll see. It is happening. Um, it stopped raining for a little bit, so we're gonna wear this new sports top that I bought yesterday at Target. Hopefully it fits. Some shorts. And a super bright yellow Habitat shirt. Because I want to make sure that I'm seen. <laughs> oh, my hair is so greasy. But I was thinking of making two small ponytails. But my hair still doesn't fit into it. That's so annoying. <laughs> I got some things over my ears to protect them from the wind. Got my headphones in, sunglasses because of the LASIK eye surgery. And this is my outfit. Let's go. Actually, let's put on some shoes first. Oh, my trusty Nikes. They're a bit, beat up, a bit beat up, but they're good for the gym. Gym shoes. Hey, bushes. Meow. Oh, you want to go inside now? Bye. Yeah, you also want to go inside, don't you? But you don't live here. Sorry. Let's go. This doesn't usually flow. This is my yard. So peaceful. I have walked 30 minutes one way and now we're gonna run back. Let's go. All right, I finished my run. Um, I'm just doing a little cool down walk now. Definitely not sunglasses weather, but um, just trying to put my eyes ready. Um, not just from the light, but also from bugs flying into it. Although, like I said, it is kind of drizzling. So, not too many bugs. What I did notice, though, two things. One, it smells like a skunk over here. And two, there's so much trash on the side of the road. There's literally so many beer cans. So, I'm going to plan and come back next week or something with a trash bag. Collect all the cans for recycling. And 
Yeah, I don't know. It's just upsetting, really. I don't understand why people would litter. It's so rude, respectless, respectless, <laughs> disrespectful. But yeah, I had a lovely run. I listened to real survival stories. I don't know if this sounds coming through my headphones right now or via my phone, but I hope you can hear me. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna enjoy this walk back home, take a shower, and get back to work. Oh, and have lunch. And oh my gosh, love the love is blind. Watch the love is blind finale. I cannot wait. Look who is welcoming me back home. Me, hey mittens. Hey mittens. Are you so excited? You're playing in the rain. Mm -hmm. Good to see you too. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I'm also hungry. Oh, it was straight into your ear. Yep. <laughs> Okay. Time to go home. Hey, why are you gnawing on my finger? I... What is that all about? I don't do that to you, do I? No, I don't. Okay. Going inside. I'm going inside. Cheese.